Howdy guys, Lee here. Today marks my one month on tea. I gave myself my fifth shot of testosterone this morning. I didn't record it because I chickened out. Maybe I'll do it next week or the week after, we'll see. I'd kind of like Mike to be here so that he can film it and it's not through the computer because that'll be really awkward trying to angle the computer. Um, Today I wanted to talk about the changes that I've noticed and others have noticed in me since starting tea. So, let's get started with that. I am happier than I've ever been in my entire life. Um, I'm more confident in myself, I carry myself straighter, I walk taller. I haven't grown in height any and I don't expect that I will. I'm 5'5". Five five. I'm a short guy, but I'm happy with it. Um, I'm hungry all the time. I want to eat all the time, which is kind of hard for somebody on a fixed income like myself, um, trying to find foods to eat all the time. Yesterday I went to the store and I got a whole bunch of fruits, um, got to go back and get some vegetables, but I got some watermelon and some avocado and some peaches and some plums and some grapes. So I'm set on fruity snacks for a while. Hopefully they don't go bad before I eat them all, which shouldn't happen. I'm, like I said, I'm hungry all the time. <coughs> um, my muscles are changing. Um, my shoulders are getting a little bit broader. They were pretty broad to begin with, but they're, the muscles are, the muscles are changing in my shoulders and my arms. And my calves have gotten a lot more pronounced since I've started tea, probably also helps that I'm walking three and a half miles, a little over three and a half miles home from work almost every day. Um, but yeah, the muscles in my arms, you can't, can't really tell through video, which is really sad. Um, but the muscles in my arms are changing. Um, my shoulders, you can't tell with this shirt on, my shoulders are getting huge. Um, I've only done one main back and shoulder workout. I need to go back to the gym or get some weights here at home so that I can start defining my muscle structure more, as it were. Um, there's a little bit more hair on my legs, I think, than there was before I started testosterone. Um, my legs are pre pretty hairy to begin with, so it's kind of difficult to judge just where hair is growing and where it isn't. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm a little bit more hairier than I was before I started tea. Um, I have acne in places I never had acne when I went through puberty the first time. Um, I woke up one morning and it's on my face. It's not bad on my face. Um, it's staying, the pimples are staying pretty small, which is awesome. But on my chest area and my back, it's ridiculous. Um, I woke up this morning to get in the shower and looked at my chest and was like, oh my god, god, that's a lot of acne on my chest. Um, but that's okay. Uh, it's one of the changes and I'm happy with it. Happy with all of my changes. I don't seem to be any angrier. Um, my, I haven't really had anything that's tested my temper since I started testosterone. Everything, I'm pretty happy with everything. Um, so we'll see when it comes to something that does tick me off, what, how I react to that. That'll be interesting to see. Um, my voice has changed in tone a little bit. I wouldn't necessarily say that it's dropped, but it is starting to change, which makes me happy. Um, like I said, everything makes me happy. Um, my face is becoming more masculine. Uh, it's changed in shape, my jaw is squaring out, uh, my cheekbones are changing a little bit. Just the way that the skin rests on my face is changing, which is awesome. I pass pretty much all of the time. I didn't really have much trouble with that before I started testosterone. 
but it's even easier to pass now than it was before. I've been taking a taxi to work sometimes, and I get started every time I step into a taxi, which is awesome. My sex drive is through the roof. My sex drive has definitely changed since I started testosterone, which is awesome. Uh, I was always pretty, um, had a pretty decent sex drive before I started testosterone, but since I've started T, my sex drive has definitely gotten higher. Um, yes, <laughs> I am much hornier than I ever used to be. Um, and in regards to that, um, downstairs has grown a little bit. No, oh, it's grown quite a bit. I'm pleased with the growth that I have gotten down there. Um, but yeah, that's, that's the changes that I've noticed. I'm extremely happy with all every the progress that I'm making, um, everything that's going on. People at work are even starting to notice a difference. Um, I'll talk about work a little bit. At work, I came out to my boss the other day. Um, I'm pretty sure HR told her that I was trans, but I had been getting sheed by the people in my department, and that was talk about something that ticks me off. That was really upsetting me. Um, so I went and pulled my boss aside one day and was like, hey, I'm transgender, I'm female to male, and she's like, yeah, okay. I was like, could y'all please use male pronouns when referring to me? She's like, I don't understand. I don't know how that's hard to understand, but she's like, I don't understand. And so I said, please use he and him when referring to me. And she's like, oh, okay, yeah, no problem. Um, is there a different name that you wanted us to call you? Because I go by Lee at work. And I said, no, 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 uh, Lee, Lee is just perfect. That's the name that I've chosen. That's what I want to go by. And she's like, okay, I'll take care of it. So she, I went back to work and she, um, she pulled everybody else aside, everybody that was there. There were a few people that were out that day. Um, but she pulled everybody aside and told them. And since then, um, since then, everybody's, I haven't heard of she at all. Um, there was one time my boss slipped up, um, and she apologized profusely. She's like, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. He. Uh, so it's awesome. Uh, they're very accepting at my work. Uh, the only downside about the job is that I have to use the women's restroom. That is disappointing, I guess, and a little bit frustrating because I'm using the women's restroom and I look masculine. I'm male. Um, so I'm going to have to talk to HR about that. Maybe once I change a little bit different, maybe once I find my STP and can start standing to pee, then, then maybe they'll let me use the men's room. I don't know what it's going to take. I'm in Texas. And they're kind of sticklers about which restroom you use, unfortunately. So, yeah, that's the changes that I've noticed since I started T, and my voice is getting scratchy again. <clears throat> um, like I said, if you've noticed anything that I didn't talk about, I think I went down my whole list. Um, please comment, let me know. Um, if you like my video, like my videos. Um, if you like my channel, please subscribe. Um, I always welcome comments, so please leave a comment. And have a great day, y'all.